Last time on this Venture Camp. Fiora wrecks havoc on Purple Team by burning some of Nick and Ashley's belongings, blaming it on Lil. On the Teal Team, Tom hides the fact that he voted off Drew, confusing the guys in his alliance. In a brutal combat challenge, the Teal Team took home immunity and the reward, while the Purple Team sent home Nick for his crappy challenge contributions and general annoyance according to Alec. Eleven remain. Who will be voted out tonight? Okay, now it's working. Yay! That? It's me! How are you? Fine, I guess. What do you want? I thought you'd want to know I'm still here. Are you taking care of my plants? How are my cats, my little birds, my fireflies, my spiders, my iguanas, my fish, and my crabs? Uh, yes. Everything you just said is fine. No need to rush home. Okay. Do you want to meet my new friends? I have to go attend to some business. Bye. Oh, okay. Bye. Mom? Hi, Gretchen. How's it going out there? I've been doing very well. I'm sure I won't be leaving anytime soon. I have this alliance. Did you hear that your brother won the football championship. I'm so proud of him, sweetie. Yes, I found out before I came. You already told me. Oh, sorry, that's old news. Guess what's happening today? Your brother's getting a certificate of honour for his high marks in university. What does that matter? I'm just so happy that someone in this family is actually successful. The university also granted your brother- You, uh, making a call, Tom? Uh, no, nah, I don't think so. My family isn't home. Fine, I'll go then. Hi, Franny, how are ya? I is mom home? Oh, they're not here. They went shopping. Oh, well, could you say hello for me? Sure. How are you, by the way? Are you okay, friend? I'm just... I'm fed up. From what? My mom can't go a single day without mentioning my stupid brother. Well... You're not the only one who feels left out in your family. Shut up! You and I are nothing alike. Don't call me friend. We are not friends, and we never will be. Okay, calm down! Just leave me alone. We should have listened to Will. He was rat all along. I miss him. Half of our alliance is already out, and if we don't do something, we could be next. Don't give up, Lil. It's not over till the rooster crows. I have an idea. I'm listening. Follow me. Well, Miriam, we're the last two. Do you want to go first? I have no one to call. Why? Quit being a nosy brat. Fine, I'll go. Hey, Sean! Hey, Jake. What's up? Is everything alright? I'm sorry. Oh no. A couple of days ago, Grandma passed away. Are you serious? Mom told me not to tell you until he came back, but I had to. You're lying. <laughs> she was conscious for a few hours before she got worse. She wrote you a letter. I'll give it to you when you get back. I'm sorry, man. 
<laughs> Jake, I I'm so sorry. <laughs> Guys, I brought strawberries for breakfast. Want some? Sure. Fiori spends most of the day writing in this darn book. If there's anything that could let us know what she's hiding, it's in here. Hi, everybody! Steel Team, I hope you enjoyed your call home. As you can see, we're doing some remodeling to the camp. You can see the beginnings of a kitchen and dining room. Which is all relevant to today's challenge. Two members of each team must cook a dish with the ingredients that the other members must obtain in the forest. We'll give each team a list of ingredients to look for. Once the cooks have finished the dish, the others will eat it. Sound yummy? Too bad! We made sure the ingredients are... What's the word? Disgusting! The first team to finish eating their team dish wins the immunity. Here are the meals. Teal team has to make a pizza out of cockroaches, quail eggs, and mud. The purple team must make a stew with worms, fish eyes, and chicken guts. Mmm, tasty. Ugh, how are we supposed to get chicken guts? I don't know. Find the nearest chicken guts supermarket. I can't eat cockroaches. They have feelings, you know. Sounds like a you problem. Time to decide which two members are cooking on each team. I can cook. Hey, uh, I, I don't think Jake's in the mood to run around looking for ingredients. You good to stay and cook with Miriam, Jake? Okay. Does anyone know how to cook? Well, I have a cookbook. Can you assist me, Fiore? Ugh, do I have to? Do you want to win? Fine. Okay, so the three of us will look for the ingredients. One more thing. This challenge is very important because the winning team will send a representative from their team to tonight's elimination ceremony, where they will get the sole vote to kick an extra person from the losing team. Extra person? That's right! The team that attends the elimination will lose two people tonight. One by regular voting and another by the representative of the opposing team. Well, if there's no more questions, then the challenge starts now! Okay, we're gonna split the list. We'll be right back. Ever since I heard from home this morning, I've been wondering if there's even a point in being here. Should I leave? Jake, are you okay? Since when do you care? You're always telling me to shut up and leave. I couldn't help but hear the call. You don't need to pity me. I know it's hard, but remember that she will always be in your heart and in your memories. We can always honor our loved ones by keeping their legacy alive, by lovingly remembering them. Huh, I... Didn't expect those words from you. I'm saying this because I've been there before. How are we going to divide the ingredients? I could do chicken. Gutting them was basically family bonding on our farm. If I have to choose, I'll do fish eyes. Okay, I'll look for worms. Well, with this bait, it won't be long before we get a roach. So gross. Ugh, let's get this over with. I have the jar ready. Great. Just be patient. Were you able to read Fiore's notebook? Yeah. What does it say? The hillbilly girl in wrinkles have no idea of what I did. I can't believe it. She's been plotting against us this whole time. I knew it. I told you. How could a little girl do this? We have to tell Ellie and Alec. But are they going to believe us? We haven't exactly been close with those two. Maybe we can use the notebook as evidence, right? 
Yeah, that'll definitely work. I don't think you'll find a recipe for worm stew. Maybe I can substitute the ingredients. Have you done this before? Uh, kind of. Do you even cook for your family? Not recently, to tell you the truth. How to make meals when we're going through a bit of a rough patch right now. Hmm, seems you have bigger troubles than cooking with worms. Tell me. It's a complicated situation. I'd rather not talk about it. Whatever. I don't really care anyway. What do you mean you've been there? I haven't told anyone about this. You can talk to me. A couple of years ago, on my husband's birthday, I wanted to surprise him with a cheesecake, his favorite, with little strawberries on top. I'm the only one who made it the way he likes. So I told my son to take him to the mall, maybe buy his dad a gift while I baked. But when I had the dessert ready, I called them to come back, but they never did. Oh. Apparently, a drunk driver hit their car. A head collision. No survivors. It took me to a dark place for a long time. Those two were all I had. I'm so sorry, Miriam. It's never easy to lose someone you love. When I heard what happened to your grandmother, it all came flooding back. <laughs> it took me a long time to finally move out of that dark place. To suppress the anguish and loneliness I felt. I tried to be tough, Jake. But it's really hard. <laughs> so you're trying to trick him? He wants to play games. I can play games. Oh, well, just be careful. We don't want to draw too much attention. Don't worry. Everything is under control. I just have to make sure he thinks he found something important, so he can stop getting in my way. You think he's gonna fall for that? I bet my bottom dollar on it. Let's just say, they didn't send the smartest spy they had. Have the guys found out that it was you who voted for Drew? No. Jake thinks it was Dan, and Dan thinks it was Jake. I have another roach! I think that's enough. Come on! Gabby! What are you doing here? Uh, carrying mud for my teams! It's one of the ingredients! Yeah, I figured. I haven't seen you in a while. What's wrong? Well, Gret won't let me talk to you. Why? She shouldn't get to control you like that. I know, but it's the only way to save myself. Dan has been nice to me, but he voted for me in the previous elimination ceremony. Even Fort Gret tries to manipulate me. She's the only person that has kept me safe. Wow, sounds complicated. Let me know if you need someone to talk about it with. I like you, Gabby. You aren't afraid to speak your mind. Really? Sure. Hey. Here's an idea. If my team wins, I can offer myself as the representative to make sure you're not in danger. And if your team wins, you can do the same. Oh, that's genius, Ellie! We can protect each other! Okay, I have to take this mod to my team, but I see you later! Half bad. You've done this before? Thank you. I used to cook with my grandmother a lot. Hmm. I think we screwed up. Definitely. 
Well, it's not like you can do much with fish eyes. Well, it all comes down to this. The first team to finish their food gets immunity. I can't believe what I'm about to say, but this is delicious. Not bad, old lady. I can't even taste them out. Come on, girls. We cannot give up. Purple team, you don't need to keep trying. The teal team has finished their food and won immunity! Yeah! Well done, Miriam! You did it! And as an added reward, you can take all the cooking utensils and the table back to your camp. Woohoo! I was happy I did well in the challenge. Cooking is my passion. And when Jake and I cook, I haven't felt that normal in a long time. I guess I judged the boy too soon. Okay, Purple Team, you're going to lose two people tonight. One to a vote and one that will be evicted directly by the Teal Team's representative. Who's going? Maybe... Me! 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 me. Can I go? Um, sure. Okay, we'll see you guys tonight at the elimination. It was convenient for everyone that Gabby volunteered. No one wants to make enemies right now. That was gross. Sorry guys, there was no way to make something better with those ingredients. Guys, we have something to tell you. What's going on? We discovered something. What Will said was true. Fiore slapped him and threatened him. Plus, it was Fiore who burned our personal items. We read it in your notebook. With whose permission did you take my notebook? Fiore has been sabotaging our team, and she can't get away with it. Wow. Well, who cares? Not me. Ellie, you have to help us. They're only saying that because they're desperate. Did they reach out to you when they were making their original alliance? Ellie, we can't trust her! How did this happen? I went from being in the worst position to deciding the vote. It feels good to have this power. Welcome to Elimination. As you know, tonight's gonna go a little different. Go ahead, Gabby. Surprise, bitches! How the tables have turned! Remember when you vote me out at the first day? Gabby has a red marker. She will write the name of one of you, and when I read the name of that one unlucky contestant, that person is immediately out. You can all go to the voting booth, write the name of the person you want out, and drop it in the ballot box. Move! Fiore, I'm voting for you. I should have realized it long before. Will, I'm voting for you so you can crawl back to whatever Disney movie your wrinkled witch face came from. You've cast your votes. Now I'll make your decision final. The person with the most votes must leave this venture camp. First vote, Lil. Fiore. Lil. Fiore. That's two votes Fiore, two votes Lil. Fourth person voted out of this venture camp is... Lil. What? But that's not all. We still have Gabby's vote. 
fifth person voted out of this venture camp is Ashley. <laughs> Goodbye, suckers! Ellie, why did you do that? I'm sorry, Lil. We were getting down to the wire, and Fiore could be helpful if we reached the merge. What in tarnation? Not to throw a hissy fit, but this is so unfair! Not really. Look at your odds. There's three of us and only two of you. Even a six-year-old can do better math than you. Ashley, Lil, I wish I could lie and say I'll miss you, but I won't. So, time to skedaddle. Y'all will regret this decision. I did my best to convince Ellie not to vote Fiore. I really like that girl. Okay, Fiore tricked us. But if she managed to do that with us, she can do the same with the other team. And that can work in my favor. I was a little nervous when Ashley and Lil exposed me. Luckily, Ellie and Alec didn't fall for their desperate attempt to throw me under the bus. The three of us are going to dominate this game. want to say hi to all the patrons that help support this awesome show. Now, let's get started. Carter Miller, Froggy RFF, Breon Thomas, Jose Moreno Lopez, Michael S. Horowitz, Holden M, Fabiano Ramirez Hurtado, Yvonne Silas, Spicy Kimbob, Nightmare Foxy 30,000, Oliver Vera, This the King, TD Fan 2077, Haley, Sophia Miller, Aries, Bad Luck AE, Epic Username, Tom Loves Yule and His Spicy Abs, Creepy Boy, Parker Acel, Rave, Chef Camaro, Dorian West, James Curtis, Spruce King, Zerk, Milo B, Acidic Echo, Charmander the Pro, Alicia Maxwell, Avi Koopa, Alleyway, Alan Duncott, Royal, Langood, James Strickland, Riley Hemsley, Cyrus, Reese R, Angel Lynn F, Amir Gaming, Owen Peters, Superhero Cat, Donny Veter Supremacy, Gabby Sunflower, N09334 Josh Mustord Molly Merced Patricia Kovacs Igloo Azalea Kiki Kawaii Alfonso Cord Vega Rick Kuma Alex Wife Critcat Amani Wheatley David Chavez Ice Mask Kobe Fisher Little Fox The Eagle Outlaw Yule's Baby Mama? Oh my. <clears throat> Mateo Diaz, Aiden Rainbow Emo Boy, Creeper Denex, Devon Wilson, Nick Acuna, UAU17, Madeira Tear, Hey It's Butter, Apimzito678, Pim Patrol, Joe Smith, Meth, Athena, J Days, Nina F. Blue Fling Gamer 45, Daryl RDKJ 11, Jack Mazuski, Rosalius 97, Regan Calamity, Steven Lopez, Subtronic, Azure, Koda Kaze, N Pex E, Felix is a Dan Enjoyer, 
Choi, Miguel Caturon, and Jedaraj22. Thank you all so much for your support. Good luck to the remaining members of Disventure Camp, and may you all get what you deserve. See you next time!